Hi guys. News from Germany this week, where for the first time since the end of the Cold War and without sounding too panicky, the German government has urged its citizens to stockpile food and water. This concept for civil defense comes from the Interior Ministry and does not see an attack on Germany's territory as likely. However, the precautionary measures that demand that people prepare appropriately for a development that could threaten our existence cannot be categorically ruled out in the future. This week I am playing a game that takes us back to the beginning of the Cold War, where players get to revisit a very tense time in the history of the world. This week I am playing Twilight Struggle. Twilight Struggle lets the USSR and United States battle it out again on a risk-like board. But instead of a full-out war, the board depicts the amount of influence each of the superpowers have on the different regions of the board. Influence changes when players play hand cards with real-life historical events. Meanwhile, there is a space race going on, giving players bonuses for being first, and there is the constant threat of nuclear annihilation. Twilight Struggle is a very tense game and is certainly not for every gamer, but there is so much good stuff going on that I feel guilty that I do not play it enough. Being able to replay historical events and see what their impact is on the globe really has broadened my view of the political world. If you have the time, please enjoy Twilight Struggle. Thanks for watching. My name is Dave Luza. See you next week.